Well, today is a new day. As I said in the previous diaries, it's it's hard to take the criticism sometimes when when something people are very um, sceptical. But what's really wonderful is when people say, "I was first. I was really sceptical when I read the news item and everything. I was really skept sceptical about who you were, what your motives were. Are you an attention seeker?" Um, Thirty one A tells you about my children. I've, I've read comments um, saying things like, losing four out of five children in this day and age, how is that possible? It's hard losing anybody that you love. Um, losing four out of five children is extremely hard and 31A um, explains a little bit about me and my, my children. Um, and also, you know, publicity, oh, um, singer, used to performing, things like that. Yes, I am used to performing, of course I am, I'm a singer. Um, but does that mean then I'm not a real person? Well, you can choose to be a real person or you can choose to be fake. And um, my dad um, and myself came from a very, very ordinary working class background. My dad and my mum did well for themselves. I was raised a lady. I probably am not always the lady I was raised to be. Um, <laughs> but I do try. But my mantra is always waking up every day and being the best person I can possibly be for that day. But for goodness sakes, I'm, I'm a human. I'm frail. I'm, I'm not perfect. Um, the situation I'm in, I'm not definitely not a home wrecker and a marriage breaker or anything like that. Um, if you watch the sequence of diaries, as I've said before, you'll see what happened and how I stepped back and we were both taken in. But, the, you know, people say, well, never give somebody another chance. We all make mistakes. We all do bad things sometimes. And if we weren't able to forgive ourselves, and never, let alone each other, we'd be in a pretty sorry state. And all I can say is... Forgiveness begins with yourself. You don't do it for somebody else. I've not forgiven the frog prince for him. I forgave the frog prince for me. It made me feel better to do that. Um, but that doesn't mean I'm weak. It doesn't mean I've got no self-respect. It doesn't mean that I can't cope with things better. It certainly wasn't um, a sub story just about him. Um, and, and that's why, really, like I say, the... The, the Froglet Diaries are a journey. It's a journey from where it began, which is pretty raw and pretty uncomfortable. Um, <laughs> I do look a state. And um, I've had comments on number two saying, are you a witch? No, not when I last checked, I'm not. Um, you know, is it a joke? It certainly wasn't a joke to me. Um, being a performer doesn't necessarily mean that I love... Um, attention just for the sake of it. Um, you know, being a performer is a job as relevant as being a plumber or a doctor. Does that mean that when a doctor goes out or does an interview that they're hoping to get a pay rise or, you know, <laughs> start treating somebody? I don't know what it is about performance, but we have a really bad um, reputation. You know, it's all sex, drugs and rock and roll. It really isn't. We're really normal people who put our eyelashes and our makeup on and our fingernails and our glamorous sparkly clothes and we do what we, we love to do and we hope that by hard work and a bit of good luck that we will get there. I never expected any of this to happen. Um, I really didn't. Um, you, you, you can either believe me or you, you don't. You know, I... I the good thing is that there's so many of you out there identifying with what I went through because you're going through it and I will try and um, you know um, get back to you one by one because I, it, it is my intention of for as long as I can um, you know trying to person be still remain real and be personally um, replying to as many of you as I can I'd like to do that um, you've taken the time to to you know check in with me and I'd like to do that back um, as far as um, the duo is concerned DV8 duo is um, we're just working on it I mean we went into the recording studio um, to um, record a couple of songs one of them is not quite in time yet it's not quite right because we we only had um, a run through before we recorded it we've got some songs up on the internet if you'd like to have a listen of course we have but I am worried about saying this because I really didn't start these diaries for fame I started them for me and then for us all um, some some of you have asked where you can hear uh, some of our music so I'm going to risk telling you 
uh, in the hope that you won't automatically get people saying, ah, you see there, you knew it was for all the attention and the fame, really, it was just a ploy. It really wasn't. Um, if you'd like to hear our music, you can go to www.reverbnation, which is one word, R-E-V-E-R-B, N-A-T-I-O-N dot com forward slash capital D capital V number eight duo D-U-O UK and you can hear DV8 duo. You can also hear Sunny Day www.reverbernation.com forward slash M double S U double N Y D A Y E. And I've also got a, a MySpace, so if you tap in S U double N Y um, D A Y E, uh, you can see the MySpace and read a bit more about us if you'd like to. Um, hopefully, you'll see that uh, you know the Frog Prince isn't all bad. He's working on himself. Uh, no, I don't trust him fully yet. That takes time. But do I trust myself? Yes, I do. I trust myself and my judgment. And at the end of the day, we can only rely on ourselves. We cannot look for somebody else for our happiness. And that's what I've learned. Maybe I forgot that. Um, it's irrelevant what the Frog Prince does now because I'm okay in myself. I would be upset. I'm upset about my mum. You know, I'm upset for my dad and my sister and my family. But, you know, my mum had 81 fantastic years on this earth. And um, my children, um, it's always hard when you lose your children. Um, it's the worst thing you can go through. And so compared to that, this is not the worst thing. Um, but as regards all the attention and the opportunities coming our way, well, you know, as I've said before, ride the vehicle to the destination it's going to go to, good or bad, live your life every day, be the best person you can be, and just try and do the best you can do. And, you know, I know a lot of you are feeling the same way I am about the ex-partner and her daughter, who's 23, not a young child at all. Um, I am still extremely sorry that my happiness is at the cost of uh, her partnership with the Frog Prince breaking up. I would not have chosen that. I don't like it. I'm upset for her as well as happy for myself at the moment. But life happens. We all have to go through stuff. And I am I know I did my best by her. You cannot force somebody to stay with somebody if they don't truly love them. You cannot force them to tell the truth if they, they find it impossible. You can just be the best person. You can be yourself. And with that... I'll stop blathering on today and get off. Lots of love and thank you for looking.